What about your Are you crown? back, Rob? Yes. Are you okay? So, um, yes. So, um, so last year and a half, um, yes. so BronyCon 2016, someone's staff fucked up and they started breaking up all the poster boards for all the rooms. Mm hmm. And Apple Jinx saved the Quills and Sofas poster board, the big <gasps> board, the foam board thingies. Mm -hmm. Really? And he's like, I have no way to get this home. So I took it. Oh, God. And a year and a half later, with a bunch of thick author signatures and Emmy Larson signature, but because it's been, it's now sagging a little, like if I'm not paying attention, I hit my head on it every time, so I have to like oh, no. shove it aside. So, yeah. It's like, it's like every time I walk down my hallway to go take a piss or take a shit, I have to fucking shove that thing aside because it's just in the way. And that's going to be our intro for Shit Face Shit Fix this week, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Shit Face Shit Fix, because we're already shit face and you should be too. Drink along with us, it's fun. If you drink during Shit Face yeah, Shit Fix. Fun. Yeah. Well, this week we have a very special guest besides Flutter Priest. Flutter Priest, say hi! Fuck. That was not the word you were supposed to say. Try again next time. I believe in you. Bye. Damn it! Fuck! Why are you always letting me down? Hi. Yay! Anyway, um, we also have a wonderful guest here today, and his name is Rob Cakrin, and he wrote my little dashi. Is that Rob Cakrin? <laughs> yes, it's Rob Cakrin! It feels like I've condensed three weeks a day. Yeah. Well, he wrote my little dashi, and so we're going to torture him by making him read fan fictions. About my little dash that other people have written. Written. Wow. Bro I've already. I've already right. Speaking of written, can we I've... address an elephant in the room on the What's similar that? stories of the one we're going to read today? <gasps> oh my god, you're right. Similar story to the one we're reading today. Living with Twilight Sparkle is weird. That's not the one I'm looking at. Well, that other one doesn't matter. Yes, it does. Fluttershy, what's in your pants? That. Fluttershy, what's in your pants is a recommended story for anyone reading this one. Well, so is yours. I know, we're horrible. Anyway, um, we're making him read horrible stories, and today we are forcing him to read a story by O. Calhoun, who's actually, like, a good writer. And this story has so many downvotes, I'm so excited. I love all the red tags. Non-con death. Suicide, self-harm. Violence, fetish, narcotics, profanity, sex, war. It's true. It's literally and every warning tag. Yep, it is indeed. Priest, would you like to read us about this story? Please do. Read us about it. Do it. This is Flash Sentry has adventures in Equestria, a cup cockes, and my little dashy sequel. Tagged for My Little Pony Friendship is Magic, Non Con, Death, Suicide, Self Harm, Violence, Fetish, Narcotics, Profanity, Sex, or Dark Romance, Adventure, Anthro, Crossover, Human, Self Insert, Fluttershy, Flash Sentry, Other, and Twilight. Life on Earth has sucked for you, Flash Sentry, but then you died because you jumping in front of a bullet to save your grandmother who had cancer. Flash Sentry goes to Equestria and save the world, a second person fan fiction starring you, Flash Sentry. This is my first story on the site, so if you don't have anything nice to say in the comments, don't be a hater! And I will be reading all the female characters, Priest will be narrating, and Rob Cakron will be reading all the male characters. Oh, God. Prologue. With a lowercase p. <laughs> you were killing a bunch of noobs on COD Modern Warfare, but then you heard your dad yelling... I hate you so much. I'm going to light the house on fire. 
An hour later, you started smelling smoke. But yo, you thought it was just your mom burning something on the stove because she always feeds you burnt stuff. Soon, though, there is lots of smoke and you don't and you know the house is literally on fire. So, you finish the match really quickly because you don't want to ruin your perfect record of a million kills and no deaths. And then you run down the stairs. You see that your mom and dad are already dead, and you shed a single tear. You leave the house through the front door, but then you hear some kittens in the attic. So you run back in and go upstairs. Most kit people wouldn't be able to see through the smoke. The, the smokey. <laughs> the somkey. But you can, and you go get the kittens, and you take them outside where it's safe. You remember, though, that your grandmother is still inside, so you rush back inside and bring her out, too. When you bring your grandmother outside, there are police officers. Since police are always kill people for no reason, they shot at your grandmother. You jump in front of the bullets and save your grandmother, but a lot of the bullets hit you. You laid on the ground and died. <laughs> Next chapter. <laughs> Interdimensional travel and stuff. You appeared in the Everfree Forest and you thought to yourself, Whoa! I'm in the Everfree Forest! But then you heard something behind you, so you turned around and you shot it with your Cat 40 pistol in full <laughs> auto! You didn't realize you had your Call of Duty guns with you, but it makes sense. When you look at what you shot, though, you saw you shot Zakora. You feel kind of bad about it. But she should not it, snuck up on you, so it's really her fault. You shrug and walk out of the Everfree Forest. Next chapter! Into Ponyville. As soon as you walk into Ponyville, lots of ponies start waving and smiling at you because they're not dicks like humans are. You're finally happy to be in a place where everyone appreciates how cool you are. The first pony you meet is Twilight Sparkle. She immediately runs up to you and says, Oh my god, I love you! You're confused about this for a moment, and you remember you're a human Flash Sentry, so of course Twilight Sparkle's gonna be all over you. She drags you fearfully <laughs> into the library, and then yells at Spike, Get out of here! Nobody likes you! And I want Flash to fuck me! Oh, after my own heart, everybody hates Spike. <gasps> Spike left. Next chapter. You forgot the capital SP. It's Spike! Spike. <laughs> First time. And then they had sex! <laughs> Second time. AND THEN THEY HAD SEX AGAIN! <laughs> Third time. AND THEN THEY HAD SEX AGAIN! Oh my god, god damn it! <laughs> Fourth time. I wasn't prepared for that one. <laughs> and then they took a little break because Twilla Elliot was tired. <laughs> AND THEN THEY HAD SEX AGAIN! I had alcohol in my mouth, it almost went out my nose when you tried it to be- TWILK IT! TWILK IT! It's TWILK IT! TWILK IT! Okay, I can do this. I can do this, let's do this. We're all gonna fucking die. I know! Fifth time. Twilight Sparkle says, Oh my god, Flash, I can't get enough of your cum. So you have sex with her again, doggy style. But they call it Pony Stele. You are almost ready to dump. <laughs> you are almost ready to dump another load in her purple pony plot. But you decide to stick it in her ass instead. So you pull out and jam it in her back door instead. She screams, but you know she's actually enjoying it. You pump another load of deadly jizz into Twilight Sparkle. She doesn't know it, but because you had so much sex on Earth, you're carrying HIV and syphilis. 
But you aren't showing any symptoms because you have a really good immune system. <laughs> Twilight Sparkle says, I love you so much. I want to be with you forever. You think. Whatever, bitch. Because now you have AIDS and you won't live forever anymore. You're happy that you made sure Twilight won't live forever. <sighs> Breathe in. We can do this. Epic battle No, we time. can't. We can do this. It's okay. No, we can't. <laughs> Guys. I can't find this feeling anymore. Guys. It's epic battle time. I can't okay. stop this feeling. Deep inside of me. Boy, you just don't realize how shit the story can be when I read it. Bum, because the vocal hurt, it makes me hurt. Bum, Deep bum, inside my bum. prune, I, I, I know how to feel. <laughs> <laughs> Milo is so worried right now. Okay. <laughs> give this a try. I'm sorry that happened. <laughs> uh, okay. Twilight says, You know, Flash, you should really fuck all my friends because, like, you're really good. Why did they make her a valley girl and I was already making her... It makes me upset. Oh, Galhoon, how dare you? You say, I totally should because they're hot and I think I might start to like horse pussy. But really, you want to give them all AIDS so that they all die. You axe Twilight. What one should I fuck for? She says, I think Fluttershy will be the hardest to get. I think she's a virgin. So you go to Fluttershy's house, but Discord is there. <laughs> <laughs> Discord sees you're about to have sex with Fluttershy and he doesn't want you to because he wants to have sex with her. Discord tried to get rid of you with his magic, but it didn't work because you dodged it. Then you shot him with your sniper rifle, no scope and headshot. Discord died and said <laughs> hit the wrong button. <laughs> Discord died. And said, wow! That was really cool! Not in that order. Fluttershy came out from her bedroom and saw Discord was being dead. She said, Oh no! Discord is dead! She was supposed to have sex with you then, but she was upset about Discrod. Dice Crod <laughs> for some reason! <laughs> Fluttershy was dumb for not wanting to have sex right away, so you drag her to her bedroom to have sex with her anyway. Queen! You're done giving her your studs. She just... Oh, wait, no, that's a quote. Sorry. Pencil, that's you. What? That's a oh. quote. S she just keeps crying. Sh is so dumb and weak. So you do the merciful thin, and you use your call of duty knife to slit open her belly from top to bottom, and you strangle her with her guts. Her rabbit was angry you. Angry you. So you strangle him with her gutses too. <laughs> I think that was a mistake because I'm pretty sure that was not supposed to be. Quoted. I don't That's care if it's awesome. a mistake. I did it anyway. I love the I love the fact that the last three chapters, the first comment is by Admiral Biscuit. So <laughs> just saying, like he comes to my he comes to my house every fucking week. <laughs> and he so. didn't tell you about this story. No, he didn't. Well, how dare really he? Disappointed. I really fucking disappointed you right now. Oh my god, okay, we can we can do this. We're almost there. Come on, god damn it! We're on the next chapter. Return. Return. When you get back to Pooneyville, you say God damn, I just spilled half my bottle of booze. That's not what he says. You say Whose turn is it? You. Yours. Mm. You say. Where are we? You say. Like very Fluttershy didn't want to, so I did it anyway, and I killed her. 
That's, oh, let me actually do that right. That's fantastic. Rarity said. Yay! Rainbow Dash said. About time. Applejack says. Yay, Pinky said. Let's throw a welcoming flash sentry and congratulations for killing Fluttershy party. Twilight says. <laughs> Sorry. Let me do this. I can do this. Give me the line again. Twilight says. <laughs> God, that's all I believe. Hercules, Hercules, Hercules. Okay, okay, okay. One more time, I can do this. Twilight says. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Well, who is going to be the new Lehman of kindness? Kindness. Kindness. That's what I said. Kindness of kindness. Lyra. Who is going to be the new? Lehman of Kindness. Of Kindness. <laughs> Sorry. Lyra <laughs> walked in and said, "Wow, a human! I want it to. I want him to do me with his hands. I like hands. Show me how to sit." But then you don't because you don't like Lyra. <laughs> <laughs> Lyra is gay, so she goes away. Probably to lick Bon Bon's horse pussy or something. <laughs> you hope she dies, but you don't really need to worry about it because she's gay and all gay ponies have AIDS already. The rest <laughs> of the main five are really impressed with how you killed Discord, so they have sex with you right there in the street and you give all of them HIV. Rainbow Dash doesn't want to at first because she's gay, but then the other four hold her down for you while you fuck her. She likes it so muck that she <laughs> turns straight. Turning straight cures her AIDS, so you have to have sex with her again to make sure she has AIDS again. I'm not handling no, I'm con. Jesus Christ. Oh my god, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. We're 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 less than like 600 words away from the end of this. Maybe less than 700. <sighs> Chapter... Who's going to do AJ? Are, are, we, are, we, are we still doing the normal? Or what are we doing? Uh, yeah, yeah. I'm, I am... Why, do you really want to be Applejack? Is that what I'm hearing? No. 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 I'm, I'm going to be Applejack then. You're still going to be the main character. Can we do this? Fine. Fine. Do it. All right. AJ. Applejack says... Wow! I'm really impressed that y'all done turn Rainbow Dash straight. Will you please have sex with me again? So you do. And AJ likes it so much she gets pregnant instantly. You say, AJ, you better go get an abortion. Oh my god. <laughs> Do it. Do it, please. She says, I can't get no abortion. God says, I can't get abortions. So you say, AJ, there is no God. Anyone who thinks there is a God is a Mormon. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Priest, we can do this. Priest, she says, I'm sorry, y'all, but I just can't do that. Rarity wants to earn money because she's a Jew pony. Hey, Flash, I'll kill the babby for you if you give me some money. Okay, says you. <laughs> so Rarity kills Applejack, and the fetus dies too. It comes out of her vagina after she dies, and every pony leaves it on the street. Uh, the other ponies all cheer. Okay, Flash Sentry. Rarity says. I killed it, so now I want my money. You knew she would ask for her money because she is a Jew pony, but you know what to do because the Jews were responsible for the, ho the Holocaust and 9-11. You kill Rarity. 
fucking what? <laughs> Let's move on and not discuss anything that happened in this section. The next chapter I'm is... I'm at an airport. So just going to say right now that I'm a little tricky. It's the next okay. chapter is called BJ. Honeycut? Oh my god. Here we go. Rainbow says to Twilly. Wow! Did you see the way he killed Rarity? That was super awesome! Uh, no, that was super awesome! <laughs> A swarm! A swarm! <laughs> Do it, do it. Right. I have over a million no killers with no death. <laughs> you say they are both very amazed. Pinky says that they should give both of you a blowjob. See. So Twilight and Rainbow Dash shove your dick down their throats as far as they can because they want more of your AIDS jizz. See. <laughs> But then Princess Luna comes flying in, and you think she's a lot harder than Twilight. Luna! Twilight pulls up to breathe and shoves Rainbow Dash down. She says, Oh, Flash Sentry, I love you so much. Will you marry me? Of course. You say, Twilight pulls Rainbow Dash off your dick and starts sucking on it again because she loves you so much. But you're over her, and you want Luna instead, so you take out your pistol. You were about to shoot her in the head, but then you remember that your dick is in there, so you shoot her in the back and paralyze her. Rainbow Dash and Pinky run away because they're dumb cowards. Rainbow will probably be deported back to Mexico, where she came from. What? Okay. You say... Luna is so amazed at you that she falls in love with you right now. Oh my god! She says, even though she's a Muslim, and Muslims don't have a real god. I love you so much! I want to give my immortality to you! So she does. And there's a lot of magic, and then you have wings and a horn, and she does not. Then Luna dies because she's a thousand years old and is not immortal anymore. You didn't have sex with her, but then you do anyway. It's okay, because she's still warm and not stiff <laughs> yet, like the five-second rule, but with horse pussy instead of food. Jesus <sighs> fucking We are Christ. almost there. That we are almost, almost there. I think that's my favorite line of the night. <laughs> the five-second rule, but with horse pussy instead of food. Uh, time to finish this up. Priest, you get to finish us. You get to drive it home strong. Though I will absolutely let Rob read the words the end at the end. How's that sound? Yes. CJ. Then you decide this world is dumb and all the ponies are fags and so are anyone who waifs it. <laughs> so you go back to Earth. Because you're immortal now, but you don't die from all the bullets and the news makes you a hero. You use that fame to become president, but only assholes get to be president. And you're not an asshole, so you don't want to be president. All the people are dumb and evil anyway, so you just play Call of Duty some more and kill noobs. Then your cat bites you, so you kill your cat. The and That was a ride. That was that was a ride. Um, Jesus fucking <laughs> Christ! <laughs> Do we have any messages for O Calhoun, guys? Because I am definitely sending them this shit face shit fix and being like, "Hi, we did a recording with Rob." Like the worst part is Admiral Biscuit has been leaving comments on this, and I know Admiral. He comes to my house every fucking week, every Friday. So I'm going to have to bring this fic up to him and go, Admiral, what do you think about this? He's going to just yell at me. You know what kills me? is this It's says marked it's in incomplete. Uh, also that. Um, it also says that this face. is a My Little Dashy sequel. There is nothing to do with My Little Dashy in this. 
Well, does my little dashy have anything to do with my little dashy? Well, f- fuck, you wrote it. You tell me. I don't know. Fuck, man. I could so really... So this was a interesting story, and by that, that I mean not at all. <laughs> I loved it. Write more, O'Calhoun. It says incomplete. Please, please, write, write more. Even right. though you said the end, you can just start out the yeah. chapter like, P.S. Yeah, do it. <laughs> Fuck, fucking, fucking okay. do it. Okay, well that, that was shit. Um, <laughs> the alcohol is loose in exactly. Rob's tongue. He's not just like, you know, this should be burned. He's like, this shit. No. It's shit. Okay, I'll do it. I fucking love you. Right, more. Oh, so that was shit face, shit fix for this week. Rob, do you have a closing word for us? <laughs> I couldn't have said it better myself.